Hi, and thank you for downloading the Cirque app. Today we're going to show you how easy it is to get up and running with Cirque. Isn't that right, guys? Well, the first thing you need to do after installing the app is to put the case on. So you simply take your device at a nice angle. You're going to connect it to the 30 pins, push it down from the top, snap it back. And the first time you use uh, Cirque and you install it, it's going to be a bit snug, but don't worry, there's no, not going to be any damage to your device. And let's simply turn on the phone and launch the app. And for first time users, what you're going to get to is a screen where you're going to create rooms. So simply tap the yellow button, create a name for it, and it can be anything you want. And you hit save or done or tap add device and it's going to prompt you to save. Now you're going to get to two ways that you can add devices. You can either search through our database of devices right over here or you can custom create devices just in case you don't find it or it's an old device or brand new even. So simply hit search and you're going to select your brand. Let's see, I'm going to go to LG and then you're going to access the types that it's available. So we have all these different types and select TV. And now it's going to our database on the, our servers and you can see that there's a bunch of buttons here and you simply tap them, see if it works with your device. If you have more than one code set, you would be able to swipe through and select your device. And if you find the buttons work, you would hit save. Go ahead and do that. And now you're in test and you see that you have the TV and you can simply go ahead and now you've controlled your devices. Well, let's say we wanted to create a custom device. So let's go edit and we'll go to device list. Hit custom. And we have all these different device types. So let's pick one. We'll pick that one for example. And it automatically pre-fills the name, but you can change it to whatever you want once again. And hit edit remote. Hit save. Now whether you found a device by adding it from the database or from custom creating it, whenever you go to edit the device, you'll get to this view. And it already has a template here of a remote where you can add and move your buttons around. You can show hide, you can change the way buttons look and what they're named. But we're going to go ahead and pair it. And you can see that they're right now all blue to mean that they haven't been paired. So all I would do to pair up is simply grab my existing remote and bring it down here. And you want to have the distance between the LEDs of Cirque and your remote fairly close to each other. You want to make sure that has uh, fresh batteries in it and that you have a nice charge on your iPhone. And I'm going to go ahead and simply tap the button I want to pair and tap the remote that I want to button I want to pair and you see how quick that was it went to green and you just go down the line tapping and you want to make sure it's a quick tap you don't want to press and hold and once you're done pairing your remote is ready to go so I would simply go back to remotes and there's my device and there you go there's lots of goodies that are available in the app and we're constantly updating it so you can check out in the help tab lots of different videos to learn even more about how to use each of the features. So thanks again for choosing Cirque and remember to please Cirque responsibly.